Hello everyone, and welcome to episode 12 of Start to Finish First of Coden 2. I checked to see which one I was before I started, thus making this the most I've ever been prepared for one of these. So, um, I think it was Futchums on YouTube pointed out that if I wanted to give Eile some fire magic, I could take some of this stuff right here and, like, let her have some fire magic. But I'm terrified about that idea. Because if I use these items, then I won't have them anymore. And that's very alarming to me. But, you know, we got some fire magic. Let's do this thing. We're here at the Cave of the Wind. We need to go find the Star Dragon Sword to go take out Necklord. But actually, I hope we're just going to be recruiting Necklord, because he's my favorite character in the game. You're weird. It's Victor and Necklord. I think you have to pick one of those. <laughs> It's like how you can't have both Frog and uh, Magus. Alright, that's not anywhere I can go. So this is the Cave of the Wind. There are going to be monsters here. Probably. Oh, I don't see why you think that. I had said there were going to be monsters. Can I fit up? Can I Can I go in here? Ooh. Ooh. Oh. Oh. Oh! Griffins! Cool. So, let's clobber some griffins. What do we say about that? <laughs> that griffin is shocked by the idea! Oh! And, alright. Ooh. There we go. I'm always a little alarmed when I run into uh, new characters for the first time. New enemies for the first time. I hope they're not just going to wreck my shit. Okay. Man, two screens, no secrets, no treasures. What's that about? Alright. Eile. 60 down. Yep. I'm gonna see. We're gonna use some flaming arrows. I'm gonna use some of these items. This way I can pick up more items for later. Man, spell animations are cool. Ooh. Ah! Rude. Alright, I'll let you guys take it from there. Okay. Nothing here, nothing there. It almost looked like a switch for a second, but clearly was not. Jump up on that. Oh! Ooh! Okay, they're not wearing jeans. That would have been weird. Let's use up that flaming arrow completely! Excellent. Best animation. I do like how every monster has their... Uh oh Their own... I'm in pain animation, and they seem to... There's a lot of variety in those. <laughs> well, when you put it that way... Oh! Sorry, Freed. You're doing alright. Woo! That was a level. Okay. So, the Minos. A little bit more to be wary of. I, mean, I guess it kind of makes sense that there are no treasure chests here, but it's kind of bumming me out. Yeah, the place Victor came a lot, he, he knows what it's like. So there wouldn't be treasure left, but... Man, I like treasure. Let's go right. Hmm. 
Alright, let's go left. Let's see if anything was left. Ha! Ah! Oh! Unfortunately, fighting griffins pays pretty well. Sweet, we got a fish badge! What? Defense plus six and a 3% chance to repel magic. Holy crap, that sounds pretty great. Who's getting a fish badge? Well, you're getting more fire magic. Go and use that one up. Alright, let's take a look. Strength. 83, 122, 94, 82, 77. But Freed's in the front line, so he would be well served having that. So let's tag. What? Why can't you wear the fish badge? Put these shoulder pads on instead. And think about what you've done. Seriously. She can wear the fish badge. That's weird. Hang on, I have to do an experiment now. Okay, you cannot wear three sets of boots. <laughs> you can... What do you think this is, a Final Fantasy game? You can wear two sets of boots! <laughs> <laughs> well, three would just be silly. Uh, yeah, three's really taking a set of Oh! Sorcerers! Well, uh, we know how to handle those. Hit them with everything we've got. They look undead, and canonically, the way to beat the undead is to set them on fire. So, let's cast some fire magic on the sorcerers. Also, let's cast a sword on the sorcerer. That also seems to work. Whoa! I just got command mad. That was weird. Okay. What's up? There's a lot more to this cave than I thought there was when I came in. Alright, now I saw a treasure over here. So this should wrap around eventually. And it did! Got the firewall spell. Oh, I just want to... Oh. I can't equip by going to item and then saying put something in the, the blank spot. Uh, 150 damage in one enemy row. Just go ahead and check that out. We're gonna use these items. Okay. Jerks! Jerks the lot of you! Health check... Eh. Yeah, we'll probably need to do that again. Alright, let's check up here. Here are these guys again. Thousand more potch. That looks like the last place we go. So up and to the right. Looks like it ends it. I don't think I'm backtracking right now, but I could be. I want to make sure I get all of the items 
in this dungeon, whatever they may be. Free it sends us home. Mega Medicine! Excellent. Yeah, I'm, I'm just backtracking now. Okay. Yeah, I went that way and got the treasure. Alright. Through here, we find more cave. Hmm. 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 Okay. That's interesting. Clearly there's something I haven't done yet to get through there. Oh, I don't care about fighting griffins when I'm lost. So I went here, and I got that. Okay, so I can't get through those boulders. There's got to be a way to get past those boulders, clearly. Ow. Free! anywhere. Do you guys mind? I'm kinda lost. I know. I And then he hit the Did I step on his I think he's dropping his mace on his foot. Just, oh repeatedly I like their attack animation too. <laughs> Leaping overhead swing. There we go. Alright. So let's go back one. Is there anywhere else I could go here? No. I feel like I went the only way I can go. How do I get that? Can't jump down. And I'm not finding any hidden walkways. Oh, couldn't escape. Alright, I'll just fight these things. I'll just let them take care of it. Yay. Okay. So let's go back up in this room. Not finding anything hidden passage-wise. But then I come here, and I'm totally... Can I push this? Yes! God damn it. I forgot that you could push things. Ooh. Hmm. I want to block this wind. Oh god! Okay, 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 okay. I get it. Um. Can you not push that thing? I can. I can push that thing. I was experimenting. Wait. Oh. Hurt. 
No, I'm good now. I wonder. Nothing else to do over here. Can I go up here? No. Okay, I'll just keep going. I completely forgot that you could push. Okay, there's that one. And stop. And up a little bit. Anything down here? Nope. Okay. Ooh. Oh, puzzly. All right. So, let's walk around here and push this all the way up. Push this all the way up. And let's push this one there. Yep, I think that's good. And then up. Okay. This isn't my first water temple. Ooh. No, 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 no. Okay. Hi. Who are you? It's dangerous to go alone. Say, hey, it's a long way out of here. Want me to help you to the exit? Um, no thank you, I'm good, but can I have all these? 3,000 potch, a blue gate, open medicine. Well, thank you, sir. What's the blue gate? It's a rune of some type. Summoning magic only goes in your forehead. Interesting. Put that back away. Okay. Up, up, over and around. <coughs> Excuse me. Ooh. Oh, why do you let me go in here if there isn't anything? Just fight conventionally, I don't care. It still worked out alright. Did we gain any XP for that? Whoa. No. I bet this way. Yes! Stone of Defense! Stone of Defense will raise our defense attribute, you know? Assume so. Always use it on the guy you know is gonna be in the party at the end of the game. I remember the Sun King! I don't remember. I feel like we fought some stuff like this in Sakoten 3. He doesn't seem very impressed by our attack. We are just kind of destroying his toes. Uh-oh. Oh god! Yes, I remember this now. Ah! No. Oh. 68 damage isn't that frightening. What the? Who gets to go twice? Oh. Medicine! Punch! Win! Alright. That was weird. Yes, I've gotten my treasure, so I'm going up this way now. And we're going up and around. Treasure! Half helmet! Find the other half, we get to keep it. Alright, that's a plus... T You're already using it. That's five for you, though. 
Hello, person from my PSN friends list. Oh! Alright. Oh, this should be fine. Attack. Auto. Clobbering. Okay. No. No. But this gains me nothing. Yeah, soon so. Okay. Menu, item, medicine, Nami. Oh. Hello, mysterious person in the shadows. It's Alright, we've done it. We don't ever have to do that again. <laughs> Everyone's got a little something to say to old Neck Lord. Turns out an undead vampire has made uh, quite a few enemies. Who would have thought? Con Marley. This dude's alright. My father and his father before him. Also wore big floppy hats. Sweet! This dude should hang out with us. Ooh, his business was a Star Dragon Sword in the Rune of the Night. Neck Lord is using his doppelganger secret to make a double of himself. The Neck Lord that you defeated wasn't the true Neck Lord! Well, that's convenient. <laughs> also, it turns out the seventh season was all a dream! Victor just learned a new word! <laughs> He's a vampire has lived for hundreds of years. He's learned a few tricks in that time. Con, making sense. Oh, we capture his spirit and put it in a bottle, and then when we die, we'll turn into vampires. Wait, this is a bad idea. <laughs> yes, let's go yell at an inanimate object. Con, I hope you haven't been here for like the last three weeks or something. It's been a little bit since I played this. If you knew what I thought you'd get that dumb old Star Dragon stupid star sword for losers yourself. Yes! Yes! Con! But, uh, possibly not permanently. Yeah, it'll be real shame when he dies. Alright, let's learn a little bit about Khan. He has a leather hat and leather shield. I can't... And he's wearing a cape of darkness. I I have no idea if he's going to <laughs> I can't change any of his gear. Oh, so did. Well, he hasn't actually... It didn't do the uh, big fist pump thing. So he hasn't officially joined yet. He has a resurrection rune and he's wielding the Shadow Bane. So uh, I feel like we got... I feel like we got him at the right time. I thought you said Bob Marley Vampire Hunter for a second. <laughs> that too. And I would watch the Abraham Lincoln Bob Marley Vampire Hunter series. I'm, I'm lying when I say that. It sounds like that would actually come out terrible as opposed to enjoyable. 
Oh, man, he's got the best coat. Oh, all right, I just want to watch everyone. Go fight, folks. Oh, Victor. Okay. He's... Yes, Victor's stats, he has, he's very high power, but he's low skill. So that means he's inaccurate. I remember that from Sokoden 1. Yes, but why? I'm interested, it's his, it's his type. Some people are very precise, low damage folks. Hey, start, oh, there's a door right here! We could have just repelled. <laughs> this is the worst cave. <laughs> hey, buddy, how you doing? Uh, Victor and a sword are having a, a lover's quarrel. <laughs> Eileen immediately just like, okay, I'll, I'll roll with this. <laughs> it's okay, Eileen, come back here. It's all right. This, this is normal. Stupid girl! Actually, stupid and girl. You're using girl as an insult. This is the sexist fucking sword. This man is nothing more than my servant. I have a butt cleft chin. That's really unfortunate. Well, he has a sword <laughs> with a chin. <laughs> I would watch an entire movie of this. <laughs> Oh, it's using itself now. Uh oh. Oh. Uh. <laughs> Victor. <laughs> I feel like I'm involved in some kind of domestic disturbance here. <laughs> this is all gone very, very weird. All right. Oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna scold it. And now we're gonna hit it with everything else. Okay, uh... Oh... Highly heal yourself. I do like how healing magic is very high priority. I kinda dig our little boss fight music here. Urgh. I'm so offended right now! Hey, 212. Uh oh. Hello. Uh oh. Ah! Alright, that wasn't that bad. Man! That's what a scolding looks like? I hate to see when you're actually upset. Alright, I don't like that enemies are going twice. I think it's just primarily attacking, so far it's just been attacking Victor, which is going to be a problem when, uh, Eileen, I'm going to have you defend and see if that's true. You're getting healed this turn. Okay. Yeah, it's just so pissed at Victor. <laughs> that's hilarious. All right, I'll just keep her defending each turn, and we can, uh, roll this thing. Unite! Defend. Because otherwise, she would not survive this turn. I should have put a soon sub back there had I thought about that. I really like how the battles are supporting what's happening with the narrative. Knocking my volume down, because my thing seems up pretty high. Is it still attacking just Victor? I was looking away. Yes. Oh, man. Oh, man. Alright. Keep going. Keep going. Charm arrow. Wow! That's a ton of damage. I'm gonna save that for, like, an actual boss. This is a boss! What am I doing? Charm arrow! It says it does damage. I don't think it's going to do... Hey, you have to cure this thing. Defend again. 
And uh, I'm going to top everybody off with a great blessing. There we go. Oh, I'm glad I did that. It's mad at everybody. Oh. Charm arrow. Whoa. Whoa. Dude, these spell anim animations are amazing. Keep defending. Really should have moved her. Oh, I got little. We win. Fittingly, Victor. <laughs> Forgive me, great God! Please forego your vengeance, oh! I, I want to hear this. Please forego your vengeance, oh star dragon sword! Am I convincing him yet? Yeah, okay. Do we have to do the thing we did from Skoden 1 again? It's a vampire with a powerful rune. <laughs> For old times sake. Come on, Star Dragon. <laughs> I'm just smiling over here. Now that we're all friends again, let's go back to North Window. Um, whoa, that's not how doors work. Yes, let's save now that we've done that. And we'll save here. I know where North Window is, but North Window doesn't have an inn. And before I go to a dungeon, I'm going to an inn. That's down here. Oh. Star Dragon Sword. Nice. Goodbye, guys. If I remember correctly, the inn is all the way to the left. Yes! For a moment, I am the smartest. Alright. Wait, hang on. There we go. All right, well, that'll do it for today. Tune in tomorrow for when we go see if we get some bitchin' organ music again. We've got Star Dragon Sword. We've got this guy. It's not going too bad. And, uh... We'll go see Matt's favorite character. Should be a good time. Alright, I will, uh... We'll do this again tomorrow. See you guys!